Hey, you know, that is a really cool skin for that F-15. <laughs> How do I install that? Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to give a quick tutorial on how to install liveries for DCS World aircraft, and it all has to do with the liveries folder in your saved games DCS installation folder. So, this was something that was asked about recently on my uh, on one of my previous videos in the comments, I believe. So. We're going to have a look at it today, so we're in the Save Games DCS Open Beta folder, which is where you need to be if you have DCS Open Beta. Obviously, it's just going to be plain old DCS if you have the stable version installed instead. And we're going to click on this folder right here called Liveries. And <clears throat> this is important because this is literally where all of your liveries that you are installing to... DCS World should go. There are some that you can stick in the um, in the core files of DCS instead, but I really don't recommend that. They will install to here just fine, and you won't have any trouble with integrity check issues later on. So, we open this up. I've got a lot of folders in here for the different liveries that I have installed so what uh, what a lot of people find hard to figure out is when you install DCS you're not gonna have all of these folders you don't know what they need to be named in order for the liveries to show up properly for that we actually have to go to a uh, different place. Program Files, Eagle Dynamics, DCS World Open Beta, Bazaar. Here we're going to go to li Liveries, and here you will find all of the folder names for every single aircraft and other unit in DCS for installing Liveries. And this is where Liveries that are installed into the DCS World Core files go. However, like I said, I do not recommend that you install them in here. They don't actually all go into here. Some of them go into a different spot. Some of them you'll find over here in Core Mods, Aircraft, and there you can find the names for some other ones. Some of them I believe will also go into demo mods aircraft you can find the names for those in there as well so if you want to find the file folder name that you need to create in your save games folder in order to actually find or in install a livery for an aircraft for example or ground unit it doesn't matter then this is the kind of place that you need to look. Obviously, it's going to be tech if you're do dealing with uh, ground units or ships. It might be in um, core mods tech as well, although not usually. Most of the time, it's going to be in bizarre liveries. And that's where you'll find most of the ones for, especially a lot of the AI aircraft and the um, FC-3 aircraft, and then also the ground units and maritime units, ships, and things like that. So what you want to do is, say for example, I want to install a livery for the F-15. I'm going to go scroll down here until I find the F-15C folder right here. And sometimes you have to be careful about this because there are two folders here, the F-15C and the F-15E. Well, obviously, the F-15C is the one I want because F-15E is AI only at this point. If you're watching this video shortly after it was uploaded, it if you're watching it later, the F-15E by Razban may have come out and that would have a different folder name. However... The F-A-18 is a really good example of where you can go wrong with this. The These two folders here are both for the F-A-18 
A and C AI versions. If we want to find the actual livery folder for the FA-18, then we need to look in here. And here, this name right here is usually what you're looking for. Something like this. F-14, if you go into liveries, you have these two. It's over in core mods. You can also check demo mods if you're not looking for the FA-18. So, go to FA-18C Hornet, and that right there is the name that you would want to use for the FA-18 livery folder, if I'm not badly mistaken. You can actually go and check that by opening up another link here, and yeah, in fact, that is where my liveries for the FA-18C are installed. So, pretty much, it's all about getting the folder that you need created in your Save Games DCS liveries folder. Once you have that created, so you can see here I have the F-15C folder created here. Once you have that created and named properly, then it's just drag and drop and make sure that the livery folder that you're dropping in there looks correct. So to do that, let's just take a look at one of these right here. If I open up this livery, you can see we've got a description file and we've got all of these different texture files that you can see right here. That is what it should look like if you're installing a livery that folder that all of this stuff is in is what you should drag and drop into your f15c liveries folder or whatever folder that you're trying to install the livery into respective to the aircraft obviously not some folder with this folder inside it so just keep that in mind because otherwise it's not going to work all right i hope that has helped some of you, and I will see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.